So guys, in this video we will be explaining the Flash's lightning color change from blue to the classic comic booky Flash Orange, because what if I told you that this decision isn't just a retcon, but there is actually a meaning behind it. So if this sounds interesting, let's hop into it. Yo what is going on guys, Flashverse here, and welcome back to another video on the Flash movie. Now, ever since we got introduced to the Flash in the DCEU, there was something unique about him, and that was obviously his lightning color. His lightning color was quite different to what we would normally see on the Flash, and that is obviously blue lightning. Now, there was no explanation behind the reason why Zack Snyder chose the blue lightning, it just seemed to be like a director preference, if you will. But after the Flash movie got announced and we got various different, you know, first looks prior to the official trailer, such as, you know, the those concept arts that we saw with Michael Keaton and the Flash and also that mini DC fandom trailer, we saw that the Flash's blue lightning was changed to that of the classic orange that, as I said, the Flash would normally have, which we all assumed to be a retcon. It was just Andy Muschietti's decision to just completely retcon and just change the Flash's lightning color to orange instead of blue. But what if I told you that through the Flash movie's official trailer, we now know that Andy Muschietti's decision to change the Flash's lightning color from blue to orange was not just a retcon, but there is actually a meaning behind this lightning color change. Now, despite the majority of the Flash movie trailer consisting of the Flash with the new orange lightning, if you would notice, these are only shots when the Flash is wearing the new suit. You only see the Flash's orange lightning when he's running around in this new suit. Now, if we have a look at a shot of the Flash without the suit, though, this is Barry still with the blue lightning. And this is still during Flashpoint, not before Flashpoint or anything like that. Because Barry over here is not only wearing the same clothes he wore, when he met the multiversal long-haired Barry Allen, but also he's looking at a picture of him younger, of his younger self, and he is in the house which he grew up as in, as a kid. And this, as I said, this is during Flashpoint. He's looking at multiverse Barry's picture over here, not his himself basically. But when Barry isn't in the new suit, we know that his lightning color is pretty much still blue. Now, if you guys think that, okay, this could still be before Flashpoint, we don't know if this is during Flashpoint or not for sure, the same thing applies to this shot over here. Now, over here, we're in a lab with, obviously, the two Barry Allens, and it seems to be like a power transferring scene or something like that, where we have, like, blue lightning going through both flashes. And once again, this is blue lightning with Barry Allen without this new flash suit that he gets in the film. This is Barry Allen in normal clothes, but once again, he has blue lightning passing through him and going into the other Barry Allen. So pretty much the new lightning color is not due to experience, it's not due to Barry, you know, getting fast or anything like that. And once again, as I've said before, it's not a retcon either. But this new suit that Ben Affleck's Batman gives him perhaps makes Barry more connected to the speed force and just further boosts his speed. And that would probably, you know, serve as many more benefits, such as gives the Flash more abilities, would help for multiversal and time travel and various other things like that. And this is why Barry gets this very, very advanced speed force suit, because it's a suit that makes him more connected to the speed force, allows him to run much faster and would help him with the time travel mission that he's going to go to and that he told Bruce Wayne about in the film. Now, if we have a look at Multiverse Flash over here, when he gets his powers, his lightning is blue. So that's how we're able to differentiate which Flash is which. This Flash still has blue lightning. It's just the new suit is what allowed him to, you know, change his lightning color to orange because he's now more connected to the speed force than before. So if we look at Multiverse Flash, his lightning color 
is blue because he doesn't have an advanced suit or anything like that. And yes, he is a brand new speedster. So we know for a fact that this orange lightning isn't a retcon, but actually the change is explained through the new Speed Force Flash suit Ben Affleck's Batman pretty much gives Barry over here. So when Barry is outside of the suit, he will still have his normal blue lightning. Now whether that will change after he wears the new suit, I don't think so either because as I said, the shot where Barry is in the blue lightning, it's a shot after he does Flashpoint anyway, so he would have been wearing the new Flash suit before. So, you know, it's not like a thing where as soon as he wears this suit, his lightning color changes. No, I mean, technically yes, but it doesn't change permanently, it's temporary. So when he puts on this flash suit, his lightning color goes orange. But when he's out of the flash suit, as we see in the shot, it is still blue lightning. So there's no retcon or anything like that. Now, yes, you could also use the argument that this could be coming from like an experience as a speedster. So maybe the more experienced Barry becomes, his lightning just, you know, changes. That could be an explanation as well. However, once again, I do doubt it because when he's outside of the suit, his lightning is still blue. Now, one thing that could also make sense is it tells you how fast Barry is actually running. Now, that could also make a lot of sense. So when Barry is, you know, running slower, for example, that's when his lightning color remains blue. And as I said, that shot where Barry's just staring at a picture and he's in flash time, like, you know, it's a shot which doesn't really require him to use that much speed. He's just staying still in flash time. So it could be that he's not actually moving that fast and that's why his lightning is blue. But the faster Barry goes, his lightning then turns orange. And that's why Multiverse Barry doesn't reach that stage yet because he's a brand new speedster. He, be he just becomes a speedster in the film. So he's gonna be a brand new speedster, barely any experience or anything like that. And that's why his lightning would remain blue for a while. But our Barry, he becomes faster. And that's why when he runs faster, his lightning just turns orange. That could also be an explanation as well. However, I'm going to stand by my theory that, you know, the new suit is what enables Barry to run faster. Because if we have a look at this TV spot shot over here, this is when Barry enters flash time. So once again, this isn't him like, you know, running that fast. He's just freezing time around him. This is Barry still with his orange lightning in the new suit. So it seems like it is actually the new suit that boosts Barry's speed rather than him just, you know, having to run faster. Maybe it could even be an explanation of both for all we know. But yeah, this lightning color change, as we saw, is definitely not a retcon. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. If you guys have enjoyed the video, please give a like and subscribe. Be sure to tell me in the comment section down below what you guys think about all of this. Do you guys think that this is a retcon or do you guys think that there is actually a meaning behind it? Be sure to tell me all of it. If you guys have any other theories as well, be sure to let me know and I will answer them in the comment section down below. And also be sure to tell me if you guys do agree with this theory or not as well. I'm interested to see all of your thoughts towards all of this. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video.